The city is huge, but there's no one in sight. It's totally crazy. Let's say there was some kind of natural disaster or war. Then how come we haven't seen a single dead body around? Come to think of it, our homeroom teacher was gone when we woke up in that amusement park. People just got erased. Why couldn't they have erased me too? like it fell towards Tokyo. I heard a few dozen meteors hit the Earth every year, but they're really small. But if a meteor that size hit Tokyo, there's no way Tokyo could. But I won't believe it until I see it for myself. Man, I'm missing this week's Electro Rangers. I hope it's recording like it's supposed to. Huh? What's Electro Rangers? Rachel, you don't know the Electro Rangers? Well then, let me tell you. Electro Rangers is a Sunday morning superhero TV show. Five different colored heroes work together to fight evil. It's four kids, but it's got a powerful underlying philosophical theme. It's groundbreaking, and fans argue endlessly over what genre it is. Oh, that's enough explanation? Well, if we make it back safely, I'll lend you all my copies of Electro Rangers. We all got brainwashed back at the theme park, right? Why did this mastermind do that anyway? Was it just so we'd play the game of fate? But it was the game itself that fixed the brainwashing. The brainwashing, the fate game, none of this makes sense. bowled over those monsters before? I don't know what happened. I thought, I gotta save everyone. And then I felt like I was burning from the inside. Was that the same for you too, Rachel? to us anyway. Hey, wasn't the curry we had before kind of spicy? It must have been rough for someone who can't handle spicy stuff. I mean, it's no problem for me, but... You, you think so? But I used the mild curry paste. Choco's always been a baby about spicy stuff. I said I'm fine! I was watching. You barely touched your food. Ugh. Why were you watching me so close anyway? Because I've seen you pass out even when you eat Star Prince curry. What? But that curry is famous for being super mild. Th that's 
just a nasty rumor. I'm totally fine with spicy foods. I eat chili peppers three times a day. I bathe in chili peppers. I even go to bed hugging a chili pepper. I wonder what that X in the sky is. You think it's a UFO? But I've never heard of one shaped like that before. And even if it was a UFO, it's just floating there and no one's coming out of it. Hmm. So who was behind the game of fate anyway? Pi said she forgot, but... But we know one of us is the mastermind, so how is anyone okay with that? We can't trust anyone, can we? So, Rachel, is it you? Hmm. Why are we camping here, you ask? Of course I want to get to Tokyo as soon as possible. But after all that's happened, everyone must be really beat, right? Besides, it's dangerous out at night. There are no lights, so it'll be pitch black. So I figured we should camp here by the shore, where it seems safer. There's only one safe spot. Oh, come on! Just let me play a little! Oh, I know. If you let me play it, I promise I'll design a special game just for you. Oh, Rachel, you didn't know? I'm a genius programmer. A self-proclaimed genius, anyway. I even won the Worldwide Kids Programming Challenge. So, I promise I'll make a game that's way better than what you're playing. Anyway, the answer is no. You can't play. What? After all that, you won't let me try? Oh, are you playing a pervy game? Don't you think this tent and these food supplies are awesome? We found them when we were exploring the area. Kansai's rock team were the ones that got the tent and the cookware. But it was our team that got the actual food and condiments. We didn't spot any people, but we found plenty of food supplies. But I made sure to leave a note saying I'll pay you later. So what was that creepy plant anyway? I don't remember reading about anything like that in science class. What must it eat to get that big? A mutation? If a company did that to people, they'd be shut down! I drink milk every day, but look at me! Come to think of it, those creepy plants were chomping on mangoes like crazy! Hmm. Maybe I'll try eating some every day, too. Got there, Tatsun. Walkie talkies. I found them in an electrical store in town. 
If we're going to Tokyo tomorrow, we'd better bring these with us. Spoken like a true son of Tatsukawa Electronics. Here, Rachel, pass them around. There's one for everybody. Wait a minute. Why does Rachel get to hand them out? Well, it's because Rachel is sort of the leader of the Go-Getters Club. Leader? Who decided that? Hmm? Uh. I said, who decided that, dummy? Yikes! Hey, Rachel! I always wondered something. You're just a transfer student, so how come you act all high and mighty? He doesn't act like that. of the Go-Getters Club, not some stupid newbie. Being a transfer student or new here is irrelevant. It is relevant. Not knowing someone long enough means you can't trust them. Rachel could even be the one behind the whole game of fate. Huh? huh? How do you figure that? Just think about it. Rachel was totally clear-headed when the Game of Fate started. Plus, he's the one that won. Rachel must have planned it all. It was all just a plot to oust me as group leader. Don't play dumb. I'm just being real here. Hey, Pie, Rachel is the one behind the Game of Fate, right? Could be. On the other hand, maybe not, though. Hey, Kansai. You need to chill out. Now's not the time to go looking for the culprit behind all this. Exactly. Especially since we've just decided to head back to Tokyo. You start down that road, and suddenly, everyone starts looking suspicious. Y yeah for sure. I've got to agree. In episode 32 of Electro Rangers, everyone's distrust caused dark energy to power up the evil monster and... Anyway, even if the Mastermind is here, getting them riled up isn't the best way to go. Yeah, probably best not to look into it for everyone's safety, too. <laughs> got it. Fine, then. I'll leave it at that. Just don't forget that I'm the leader of the Go-Getters Club. I'm the real leader, and this badge here proves it. Huh? A badge by itself doesn't mean anything. Does too! Only true leaders can wear it. It's the real deal! or something? No, I don't think so. It's... What the hell are you talking about? Huh? Why are you staring at the ocean like that anyway? Who? Huh? <gasps> Could it be? None of the others? Can see what we do. saying the whole time. Fukuoka's the busiest freaking place in Kyushu. If we go there, we'll definitely find somebody. Hold on. I thought you were no good at social studies. Hey, even I know about Fukuoka. Because they got a baseball team. I told you, Kansai. Our goal is Tokyo. The best way is to go to Oita, then over the water to Ehime, and across Shikoku. Going to Fukuoka would be way out of our way. I totally agree. 
But our goal isn't just to go back to Tokyo. Our goal is to figure out what happened to Tokyo. Right. Now that I think about it, we don't really need to walk all the way back to Tokyo. If we find an adult somewhere, we can have them take care of us. Then we'll find out what happened to Tokyo, too. I'm sure the police or the defense force or whatever would take us back to Tokyo. So the first thing we gotta do is find an adult. That's why we should head to Fukuoka. But even if we do go to Fukuoka, it doesn't mean we'll find an adult. But there's a good chance, right? Better than going to Oita. It's way out in the boonies. Whoa! Whoa! Don't be dissing Oita. Oh, that's right. You're from Oita, Pai. Yeah. And for your info, Oita City is pretty trendy, being the capital of Oita Prefecture. Huh? We even have lots of traffic lights. <sighs> mm. <laughs> hey! Those of you for Oita, say something! Uh, uh... Sorry, Pi. I can't lie to myself. <laughs> well, it's decided then. Yay! We're going to Fukuoka! Wait, that's not what I'm saying either. I'm for the short route through Oita because I hate walking. <laughs> but Fukuoka's got udon, mochunabe, and spicy karo! Uh... Don't forget about tonkotsu ramen! Okay, it's settled then. Oita it is! Tonkotsu ramen is my least favorite food in the whole world. I really want to go to Oita too! They're famous for hot springs. And I want my spoon to get nice and soft. Why, Oita? I said I hate the smell of tonkotsu pork broth. Well, hot springs stink bad, too. Whoa! You're dissing Oita again! Don't you guys want to see the Fukuoka Dome? The only dome I want to see is the Lava Dome on Mount Takasaki. There's a famous video game company in Fukuoka. What's that got to do with anything? So what about you, Rachel? Which way do you think we should go? Hold on, are you serious? Hooray! Rachel's on our side! Thanks, Rachel! It's set then! Huh? How'd you figure? Oh, yeah. We haven't heard from Pochi yet. Who? Me? Pochi, you're definitely going to choose Fukuoka. I mean,. Fukuoka is a beautiful city for adults. So, you know what I mean, right? I... Uh... All right. Come on, let's go together, Pochi. I... <laughs> okay, I choose Fukuoka. Okay, so that decides it. No point in arguing over it now. Aren't you guys forgetting someone? Aniki, 
I thought you were going to go your own way. Yeah, I was. But then I changed my mind. My choice is... One vote for... Oita. Well, uh, I didn't choose Oita because you want to go there or anything. Oh, I get it now. Wait, what am I missing? What is it? For crying out loud, boys are so dumb. Huh? Huh? Well then, things are even now. We'll never reach a decision. Uh. <sighs> well then, so be it. We'll just have to split up. What? We're gonna go to Fukuoka no matter what. So you guys do whatever you want. No biggie to me. But, but... See ya. Hey, wait! Katsai! Wait! Chuko! Nioro! Tatsun! no way to stop them. They'll call us by walkie-talkie before you know it. They'll be like, oh, we were just worried about you, or some crap like that. But... Oh. Well, we'd better get going too. Destination, Oita. Let's go. Yeah, it took way longer than we planned. It's all your fault, Mochan. Any little smell along the way, and you got sidetracked. Sorry! You don't have to apologize, Mochan. And you're the slowest walker ever. What have you got in your backpack anyway? Um, not much. Scones, Don Tacos, Porinki. Then some Karamucho and Supamucho. That's all junk food! Not all of it! I've got some peaches I found in Kagoshima! They've got to be rotten by now! Throw them away! Oh, come on! I'm really sorry, everyone. I know I'm always dragging you down. You mean dragging you down? Idiot. Stewed mutton with thick broth. You're a serious pain in our butt. You are not a pain in our butt, Mochan. Yeah, don't worry about it. Totally. Thanks, everyone. <sighs> Good thing we don't have the Fukuoka group here. Kansai Choko Nyoro. Hudson and Pochi, huh? I wonder what they're up to. It's been a while since we split up, and we still haven't heard from them. These walkie-talkies only have a range of a few kilometers at most. If they keep heading towards Fukuoka, there's no chance we'll be able to talk to them. I couldn't give a crap about them anyway. They can all go get lost in the woods for all I care. Aniki, why are you so nasty? Even if you are tired, don't take it out on others. <laughs> Soon all that nastiness is going to melt right out of you. Huh? We're almost at the Beppu Hot Springs. This city looks the same. Not a single person around. 
Maybe everyone was eaten up by those huge plants we saw in Kagoshima. Oh, big bro! Could you be any more insensitive? You know Pi was born and raised here, right? What? Really? I knew she was from Oita Prefecture, but I didn't know it was this city. <sighs> Sorry. No, it's fine. It's definitely a big shock to see the city I was born in looking like this. But all my family is in Tokyo. Oh, really? But even Tokyo. The truth is, we don't know how things are there either. Mm. <sighs> anyway, let's keep looking. Forget what I said before. There might still be people around here after all. Yeah, that's right. Well then, let's split up into three teams like before. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Right. We have three teams now. Rachel and I will be in the rock team. Jenu and I are in scissors. Big bro and I will be paper. Any objections, Aniki? Not in the slightest. Leave Big Bro to me. I'll take good care of him. All right, let's get moving. Use the walkie-talkies if you guys find anything. Got, Got it. it. Let's go, Rachel! Uh, where should we start? Uh, well, was that... Pi? Let's go! Rachel, Mochan, we've got trouble. What happened? Look over there! Somebody stop it! Huh? What? What the heck is that? It's probably its mother. It, it's a giant California roll! It's a roly-poly, no doubt about it. I don't know. It must be like the giant plants in Kagoshima. Some kind of mutation. But why did it take pie? Well, when I found it, I got super excited. So I was poking it and rolling it around, and that must have made the mom mad. I think it might actually be a dad. Who cares? The important thing is that pie got caught by it! Yeah. What do I do? What can we do? We have to try to stop it. If the three of us work together, we can do it. Let's go! No! Wait a second! Mochan, you... Sorry! My legs just froze up! I can't move!
Huh? Where's Pi? You rammed into her so hard, she went flying! Oh no! Anyway, what happened just now? It looked like your body turned hard, like iron. Well, uh... The same kind of thing happened in Kagoshima. Yeah, and Rachel used some kind of strange power too. Ugh. Anyway, it's Pi that we need to worry about right now. But what if we run into more of those roly polies? It'll be okay. With your powers, I think we'll be all right. Our how? Yeah, Rachel's throwing ability and your ironclad ability. I don't know if I can do it. I know you can. There's a saying in the Huseki Zuka troupe: where there's a will, there's a way. Not terribly original. Anyways, let's get going. We've got a bug to chase. The roly-poly that has Pi went rolling down that way. Got it. Let's go! This one is different from the one that rolled away with Pi. Uh. Rachel, leave it to me! Mochan. Let's go! I'll beat him up! And Rachel's throwing ability, too. Whatever the deal is, we need both of your powers. You're going to have to get us through this. Got it! Leave it to me! And don't worry if you get stuck in your iron form. I know a manager of a bowling alley. Uh, I'd rather not imagine that. I'll do my best!
Let's hurry after her! What do I do?